My father never chooses me for anything. If he needed a kidney and I offered him mine, well, pff, well, he'd take it because he was dying. It's not that he doesn't love me, because he does. It's just that special kind of love that, you know, feels like neglect. Come on, Dad, pick me, pick me. I'll take little Sammy. Hey, just because he's a gimp doesn't mean he can't hit way better than you. Don't be prejudiced. Let's go, Tin Man. <laughs> what? You deal with enough rejection in your life, you grow a thick, hard catalyst on your soul. Anybody shakes hands with my soul, they know that soul's done a hard day's work. I feel that. That's a man's soul! <laughs> Kathy and I are getting married in a month. You want to be the best man? <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. You can find, like, a homeless guy? I'm serious. You're my son. You're an adult. Now I think of you as my friend. Yeah, I guess. Okay. <laughs> and, uh, Kathy wants a rehearsal dinner. Maybe you could, uh... Yeah, a rehearsal dinner, yeah, well, you know, best man makes a toast, blah, 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 whatever. <laughs> My dad has never treated me like a friend before, you know? He's always treated me more like, you know, an enemy. <laughs> an enemy whose baby shoes he hung from his rearview mirror. <laughs> <laughs> You're beautiful, Christopher. <laughs> okay, it's cut before he distorted the shape of my skull. And it just shows how much my dad loves me. All right. Congratulations, son. <laughs> What? Okay, back that up. Cut there. Ha ha! Up till then, I wasn't humiliated by having my pants taken down in front of my friends. And Dad looks so supportive. <laughs> and this one shows Dad as a drunk driver. Okay, can't show that one. That's it. I've taken the best moments of my father's life and compiled them into a heartwarming Three and a half minutes. <laughs> Who is the bestest best man? <laughs> to my father, to my teacher, to, well, my best friend. Thank you for making me your best man. That was lovely. And it reminds me, I don't want him to be your best man. I want it to be my father. <sighs> Dad? Hey. She does sex with me, you're out. you put into this party, you should be the best man. I am furious. Oh, I am so, so I am furious. <laughs> he has messed with the wrong guy. Tommy Denno, wait, wait, it's okay, okay? You don't have to go get in his face. Oh, thank God. <laughs> Look at me, <laughs> I'm shaking. <laughs> Honey, come over here. Listen, don't be mad at your father, be mad at Kathy. She's the evil one. Ugh, I hate her. Honey. I mean, she's a shrew, she's not even human. She's half dog, half wolf. <laughs> You know, we shouldn't judge her until we've walked a mile in her hooves. Oh. So you are upset. No, 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 no. I'm over and I'm not mad. Honey, you know what? I, I really hate that. You are never, ever upset when I am upset. Why can't we be upset together? Okay, next Saturday, I'll tell you I have a big butt and we'll make a night out of it. <laughs> Dad taught me that when you reveal a weakness, you reveal you're human. And humans die. Of course, they squirm first. That's the part Dad likes best. He can't hit! He can't hit! Your mother's in a mental institution. You're out! You've got to learn to tune out the hecklers. Tommy's up next. He wets the bed. Hi. My sister says she feels awful about taking away best man from you. Well, you know what? She should. I'm just kidding. She never said that. 
<laughs> you know, this really means a lot to Christopher. If you could put a word into your daughter. Uh, of course, you'd probably have to first swallow the phlegm ball that's making the noise. <laughs> Sorry we're late. We were in the parking lot having sex, if you knew what I mean. <laughs> he kills me. <laughs> yeah, he's special. The best man's asleep. Oh, perfect. But I, th I thought you were the best man. No, Dave. Kathy made Papa Titus replace him with Kathy's father. She's an <gasps> evil, vicious motard. <laughs> What is that? Made it up. <laughs> so you're not best man. Dude, I am so sorry. You spent hours in that speech. <laughs> no, I didn't. Yes, you did. Hours and hours and hours. That's time you'll never get back. Ever. That's time you could have spent having sex with Aaron, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Dave? Everybody's cracked your little code. My brother Dave has two God-given gifts. One, he can take the lowest point in your life and just amplify it so you have a new lowest point in your life. Lisa, Lisa, Lisa. I'm sorry, dude. You'll never find another girl like her again, huh? Uh, Lisa! And two, he can lie on his back Fill his mouth with milk and let a dog drink out of it. <laughs> you can't do that. Dude, so what if Lisa was perfect, huh? Look what I can do. <laughs> Lisa used to drink out of my mouth like that. <laughs> Everybody, the best man would like to give a toast. <laughs> oh, right. Dad. Dad. What? Your toast. Oh. Down the hatch. Wait, that's it? <laughs> down, down the hatch? Honey, you should give your toast. Oh, no, nobody follows down the hatch. He's good. No. Everybody, Christopher has a toast. No, I don't. Honey, stop, it, stop, it, stop, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. I am not getting up. Oh, Honey, I will not be outdone by Greta Von Wackbag. <laughs> what? What does that mean? I don't know. I just have so much hatred inside, I don't know what I'm saying. So just get over there and be funny or no more Kudo Bobby for you. <laughs> you got a funny speech? No. Yes. He does. <laughs> it's hilarious. It puts down the hatch to shame. <laughs> well, everybody, everybody, quiet down. My son is going to make us all laugh. Let the magic begin. <laughs> My dad is full of support and encouragement. He just makes it feel like abandonment and betrayal. It's his God-given gift. It's as if an angel touched him on the head and said, Go thou forth, Kenneth and rip thy boy a new one. <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> it's an honor being chosen to be my dad's best man. Was. Was an honor. <laughs> <laughs> uh... <laughs> you know, dad doesn't really need a rehearsal of dinner, because he's been married, what, five times? I'm pretty sure he knows his lines by now. It's, uh, I will, I do, and get the hell out, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Dad also, you know, recycles the uh, figures on top of the wedding cake. You know, you know the one where the groom's face down in the icing and the bride is talking to her lawyer. <laughs> well, that was funny. Huh? It was not. There's nothing funny about alcohol abuse on cakes. That's enough. Sit down, Spikey. Okay, you're right. You know, I was gonna be Dad's best man, but I guess I'll just have to wait till the next wedding. <laughs> Lucky for me, it's never that long a wait. <laughs> Down the hatch. Are you gonna let him talk to you like that? Are you gonna let him talk to me again? <laughs> I hate to disappoint you, but there's not going to be another wedding. For Kenny, I'm the end of the line. That's for sure. <laughs> Your father's made.
made some mistakes. He had you, he kept you, and he adopted Dave. That's a failure trifecta. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, and she cooks, too. I love these things. Everybody gets slammed. I turned your father's life around. He doesn't drink anymore. He does it. I did that. Me, right here. Tell him. I'm his savior, not you. You know what you are? Tell us. Not the best man. <laughs> oh, boo hoo, Daddy. I made a video. Daddy, please love me. <laughs> That's why I love her. Hey, is, do Christopher when he's angry. This, this is hilarious. Oh, oh. <laughs> I'm never sure if you're angry or if you swallowed your tongue. <laughs> There's certain lines you don't cross, you know, because once you cross those lines, it changes the nature of the relationship. <laughs> Screwed up people aren't aware of these lines. <laughs> and I don't know what that line is for me, but I am pretty sure Kathy crossed it, man. I can feel it. <laughs> okay, Kathy, you want to play? <sighs> Dad's drunk driving video. I think Kathy is going to give it a hey! Hey, Kathy, here we see Dad weaving into the drunk driving checkpoint. Two wheels on the sidewalk. Hmm. Thank God you got him to stop drinking. Turn that off. What are you going to do, make me not best man? Mm -hmm. ah! I don't want to say this. <laughs> yeah, Kathy knows a good action movie when she sees one. And okay, now the cops want Dad to step from the vehicle. He opens the door. <laughs> And the nice officers help him right back to his feet. Hey, hey rewind that tape. That black cop pushed me. <laughs> okay, now he's attempting to touch your nose, Tess. He put the beer down first, thank God. But I'm pretty sure he's supposed to touch his own nose. Touch his own nose. Anybody else seen a cop that pissed off? <laughs> Besides Dave. <laughs> oh, okay, now, now here's a switch. A lady cop and Dad's frisking her. <laughs> uh, it was an old high school sweetheart. Uh, uh, does anybody else have a toast? Down the hatch. <laughs> kitty cat, kitty cat. Uh, I, I told you all about that, uh, didn't I? Sure I did. You remember? Sure you do. This is your knight in shining armor? You poor thing, you poor, desperate thing. But I know he loves me. You poor, desperate, older-than-me thing. <laughs> look, look, Kathy, I, I, I... The wedding's off. We're done. Greta Von Whack Bag, I'm getting some Koodle Boppy tonight. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Talk about an overreaction, huh, Dad? <laughs> Kathy. What is that? What are you doing? <laughs> Nothing. You're not crying. You don't cry. Stop crying. You made Dad cry. I did not. Shut up. <laughs> Get me some milk and a dog, quick. <laughs> Dad. Kathy! Dad, Dad, come on, you're kidding, right? <laughs> you're an awful, awful man. I'm taking this. <laughs> Hand me that. Hey! I hope they charge you for this. Uh, Dad! Go, go, go away. I, I don't want anybody to see me like this. Uh, <laughs> well, the bread was Kathy's sister. I'm not quite sure who that was. <laughs> Dad, look. Everybody's pissed at me. You got me, okay? Doesn't matter. Leave me alone. Come on, Dad. This is weird. You're acting like you have feelings. Give me a bottle of whiskey and a glass. Oh, Christopher, fix this. He's drinking. He shouldn't be drinking. Well, it's an open bar. <laughs> Christopher. Okay, okay, all right, all right. Dad. Dad. Look. Ow! <laughs> you and me outside. We're going round and round. <laughs> Dad, Dad, look, 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 this is for the best, okay? Kathy was just the heart attack rebound <laughs> chick, man. There's other fish in the sea. Yeah, but where am I gonna meet another woman like Kathy? Hey, maybe you could have another heart attack. <laughs> <laughs> uh, um, 
But what about the bartender, huh? I mean, I mean, no, no, check her out, man. She's your type, she's hot, and she can tap a keg. <laughs> a salamander can lose its tail and grow a new one in three weeks. My father can score a new tail in three minutes. <laughs> That's it. I want a divorce. Hi. <laughs> Mr. Titus, I think I have some words here that can help, if I may. Shut up, fruit! Well, <laughs> when you say shut up, fruit, what I'm really hearing is... Shut up, fruit! That's what I'm hearing. <laughs> I can't... I can't... I can't watch him like this. Well, honey, I I'm gonna hate myself for saying this, but you have to do the right thing and go get Kathy back. Well, I hate you for saying that. <laughs> well, it's not hate, but... So I'm annoyed. Do the right thing. No. Do the right thing. No. Do the right thing. No. Okay. <laughs> That's me. <laughs> no. Christopher, do the right thing. Oh, all right. Dad, I'm sorry. <laughs> Look, Kathy. Ow! Bastard! <laughs> Kathy, look, I, I came to apologize. Again, Papa! No, ow! <laughs> I was hoping Ken would come out here and beg me to stay, but of course all I get is you picking a fight with my crippled father. No, 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 Dad, Dad actually loves you. I mean, he hasn't had a drink since that night, and he's in there right now crying his eyes out. Kenny doesn't cry. No, no, no. Uh, yes. Why would he cry over me? Well, because you're such a terrific lady. <laughs> yeah. They say that lying causes tumors, but that hasn't been proven. <laughs> this? It's just an ingrown hair. Relax. No, no. Your father and I will never work. He lies about his drinking. Yeah. And I see the way he looks at other women. Yeah. Obviously, I'm not pretty enough. Yeah. <laughs> right. <laughs> you? <laughs> not pretty enough. Oh, come on. Huh? You're way pretty enough. You're almost too pretty. <laughs> really, really pretty. <laughs> wow. Dave actually calls you really pretty Kathy. <laughs> oh, this is nothing. This is probably a bite I scratched it too hard, you know? <laughs> You know, maybe like a spider laid eggs in my neck or something. <laughs> Treat my daughter like that! Ow! Ow! Hey! 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 hey. Ah. <laughs> and you have a very pretty girl here. I would defend her too. Look, I know I'm pretty. People are always staring. Yeah, oh, well, you're a traffic stopper. Your father will just hurt me again. No, 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 no. You, you changed him. He needs you. The whole family needs you. In fact, Aaron wants you to be maid of honor at our wedding. Oh, my God. <laughs> it's probably benign. <laughs> Maybe I'll just buy a hat for it, you know? So can we just go get you and Dad back together? <laughs> All right, thank you. Let me just go fix my face. Oh, there's not a thing you could do. <laughs> Stop flirting with me. I'm not that much older than you. <laughs> and don't think I don't know that. <laughs> Oh, there's a highball. Oh. <laughs> uh, huh? Dad, oh. what the hell are you doing? I took your advice. I caught another fish. Check out the gills, huh? And the boobs, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Dad, I just got Kathy back for you. Well, nobody asked you to. Yeah, who wants her 
back. <laughs> then what about the tears? I saw you crying. I saw you. Oh, I did that to humiliate you in front of friends and family, like you did to me. Watch. Kathy! Huh? <laughs> oh my God, Kathy! <laughs> oh my God, Kathy. <laughs> hey, you, uh, Betty, Kathy, Kathy, Betty. You lying, cheating drunk. Hey, you slapped me and you walked out. My son was right. I was on a heart attack rebound. We're not right for each other, just like he said. You told me I was pretty! <laughs> but I thought Dad wanted you back. <laughs> You set me up, you little bastard. I didn't set her up. I meant it when I did it. Oh. Ah! We'll see who's prettier now. Me or the guy with no head? Oh, crap. Another wacko with a gun. Damn! <laughs> Bad time for criticism. Okay, Kathy, when, when I said you were pretty, I really meant it. Aaron, tell her how pretty she is. Uh, pretty Kathy. See? <laughs> Kathy! I think I can put this all into perspective. <laughs> <laughs> Wacko! Dad! You're all a bunch of liars! No! Oh. I'm back. <laughs> My father never chooses me for anything, unless he needs a human shield. 30 years and all I am to him is a hunk of meat to block buckshot. <laughs> I told you Dad needed me. <laughs> Who's the best man now? I'm the funny one. No, I'm the funny one. No, I'm the funny one. I'm the funny one. Okay, fine.